The new day has dawned in the Gambia. Musa brought his dog. Actually, it's the dog of Kim and Berne, huh? Mm -hmm. She's so scared. You're so scared. Just take it easy with him. Take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. I thought it was just another wingo worm case. Not worth mentioning, but then Isa too showed me something. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Easy, easy. It's okay. It's okay, Chico. Isa too showed me something, and of course Musa said it was only there two days ago. Just two days ago. Musa, this is ten days there. Seven to ten days. Mm. But you have to check it, you have to touch it, you have to look at it. That is the thing. Huh? If you don't do that, then you miss it. And you just... If you don't check the dog, a dog needs to be checked every day. Every, every day you need to touch it, to look at it, I not just throw the food. You need to check it. Yeah, like if you have a girlfriend, you know? Girlfriend, yeah. you have to check every day. Yeah. Huh? And the more time you spend with Chico, the more he will be relaxed too, because now he's so scared. I guess he's only touched when there's a problem. So it's better to touch him every day, then he will realize that being touched is nice. So now I will knock him out, okay? We take the hammer and make him a bit sleepy. The hammer was successful. We hammered him down. Big hammer. So, Musa, mm -hmm. everywhere where you see or feel a lump, mm -hmm. you have to press, and then, surprise, surprise, a worm comes out. A tiny little worm. Mm -hmm. And this tiny little worm is called Tumbu or mm -hmm. Sah. And it's not belonging in these animals. It is a parasite. And here, mm -hmm. let me show you, we have a very bad spot. You see? No, don't do, don't do it too hard. If you do it too hard, you might burst some of the worms. It's better to do it with gentle pressure in such a spot so that they can come out slowly. And once they are all out, we can collect them. Like poker chips. You know poker chips? Yeah, poker chips. Poker. Very good. Now you get the hang of it. I thought that this the food caused in this. No, how can the food cause this? The food goes inside the body. Inside this the body. is on the outside of the body, in the skin. Mm -hmm. It is a fly that goes around and puts the eggs, mm -hmm. that flies around actually, mm -hmm. and puts the eggs in a spot where it smells of dog or it wears a little bit stinky. It doesn't even have to be very stinky, just a little bit stinky. That's the trick for the fly. And then the dog goes there the next time. Maybe he has even dug a hole. Did you see him digging a hole in the garden? A hole, yes. And then he lies in this hole, mm -hmm. repeatedly. Mm -hmm. And there we go, because then, if he lies there once, twice, three days in a row, the hole has a smell from the dog's body. Mm. And that is what the fly is looking for. She puts the eggs, and then the eggs are just sitting there and waiting for the dog to show up again. Mm. Yes. And once the host has arrived, the eggs are hatching, and then the tiny, tiny maggots are drilling into the dog's body. And that's why it's usually on the lower side of the body, or on the, on the chest, on the lower part of the body or on the sides of the body is usually not on the back because the dog usually does not lie on its back. But in the end, the key to success is always to check, check, check. And then if you see him digging a hole, for example, okay. you can close the hole again. The hole again yes. You can sleep, let him sleep there one night, maybe two nights, but then you have to close it and he has yeah, to yes. find another spot. Otherwise, it will end up in a disaster. I closed the holes. Yes, please. That's what you have to do. And then Chico will grow into a nice big boy. Mm -hmm. But as I said, the, the daily handling is very important too. It's a puppy. You have to play with him a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Give him some food from your hand. Maybe you put the lead and take him for a walk. Mm -hmm. Do you take him out I sometimes? Out. 
beach. Sometimes, yeah. yeah, not sometimes, daily. Mm. Should be like daily routine. Mm. That would be ideal. Ugh. You see, here we have some mm. inside, inside. Oh. It's rather nasty. I should have put on gloves for this, honestly. <sighs> mm. Nasty, nasty, nasty. And interestingly, the, the worst part when it comes to mango worms is on the ears, because here on the ears there is absolutely no space for them to grow. Mm -hmm. When they grow a little bit, they already hit the cartilage. So right away it becomes inflamed and very painful. That's why there's so much blood here and pus here, although the worms are not even big. In general, it's always about space. The parasite doesn't want to kill the animal, but if there are too many parasites in the same spot, then they're running out of space, and then the problem starts. Then you have infection, inflammation, things like that. I think this is a two-hand spot. Can you try, please? Can you get it? Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. So, long story cut short. You have to check your dog every day. And if you see a problem arising, like these parasites all over, mm -hmm. you have to do something fat fat mm -hmm. right away. Mm -hmm. Not wait another two, three days to see if it by miracle disappears, miraculously disappears. It will only get worse. Mm -hmm. And worse and worse and worse. Really, sometimes I ask myself, how is it even possible that we have dogs in the Gambia? Because, huh? Mm. They should be all dead from their worms. But somehow they survive, survive, survive. And reproduce, reproduce, reproduce. Good guys, I think I'll leave you to it. Ah, I said we forgot to count. Very bad, huh? More than ten, I would say. Yeah, after we will try him. Musa, well done. You're doing a good job. Because a lot of people are too squeamish to even do this job. So whenever I see somebody doing it, I'm very happy. And while Musa and Isatu are focusing on Chico, I ask the next customer to come in. And surprise, 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 the problem is... What's the problem? Monsieur, what is the problem? Worms. Worms? Mm -hmm. Chico done. And then we had the dog from Mohammed called mm. Teddy, no? He's called Teddy. We gave him an intramuscular injection to become a little sleepy. And in the meantime, I asked the next person to come in. This dog, unfortunately, ah. is called Hitler. Mm -hmm. But Hitler has the same problem as everybody else in this country. <laughs> Worms, 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 worms. Hi. Ah, but I think Hitler is much worse than Chico and Teddy. Because he's all over. Well, my this goes on for some days already. Yeah? It didn't start yesterday. No. Hmm? no when did no, it start? No. Two weeks ago? No, it's more than two weeks. Mm, yeah. I think so too. Hitler, welcome to the clinic. Now the dog is sleeping. You don't have to hold it so tight. It's relaxing. 17242, I think.
I operated him last year, huh? Yeah, two for two. He was here last year for the operation, no? Operation, no babies. No make babies. Okay, guys. Mohammed. You have to press now all the worms. All the worms have to come out. Okie dokie. Use two hands. Two hands system. When you feel a lump, you press it and then the worm can come, come out and go in the pan. Perfect. I think it would be best if we make him lie on the side. Then we start with one side and when we are done with one side, we move to the other side. Everybody can join in. Grab a spot of the dock and look for lumps and bumps and then you press it. Lumps and bumps. Mango worm Saturday. That's the problem because this year is so cold in Gambia that the dogs are digging a hole. Did he dig a hole in the house? I said, well, can you repeat the story that I just told the other guy about holes? Holes in the Gambia. Mm. <laughs> what? <laughs> Dog house? Yes, of course, I have it. It's ten thousand dollars. Hmm? Actually, we have something like a dog house. It's a dog tire. If you want, we can show it to you. It's really cool. Dogs love it. But it doesn't have a roof. It only has a, the first floor, ground floor. I said, we should start producing dog house here. <laughs> yes. In our spare time. Number three. I said, which one is the worst? This one is the hmm? most. Hitler is the worst? Yes. You see, Hitler was always the worst. <laughs> Interesting, huh? Although, actually, I think. As history is written by the people who are winning, hmm. maybe some other people were very bad too, only it's not in the history books. Ugh, stinking. Hmm. Yeah, Mohammed, this really goes on for a long time. Huh? Yeah, yeah. Good that you finally found the way hmm. to us. Yeah. I said to you, your job description is. Professional mango worm remover. Mohammed, come and look at this end here. What do you see here? Okay, there's infection there. I don't know. No, it's actually an infestation. Uh, okay. You see all these small dots here? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. These are fleas. Mm -hmm. There are 1,000 fleas sitting here in this pot. Do you have chicken at the house? Yeah, we have fleas. They come from the chicken. Mm -hmm. And they go to the dog and they make the dog go crazy. Oh. Very bad. Yeah, I agree. Hitler is the worst. It's the worst word. <laughs> I said too. You're too dangerous. Because I was just standing here, pretending to do some work, and then you shoot at me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and me and the whole rest of the surgery. Nasty. Really nasty. Hitler is getting there. Mohammed, the word that comes to my mind is disgusting. Mm. Disgusting. So there's a lot of room for improvement in, yeah. in the dog's care. Mm. You see that? Okay, today Mm -hmm. He will take some injections, some antibiotics and some drug called ivermectin. Mm -hmm. And then on Monday we have to see him again. Okay. okay. Because, as I said, it's fairly bad. I said to already explain to you about the, the tablet, no? The wonder drug? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not yet? Mm 
Okay, because we have a tablet that can take care of all these problems, okay. but first the worms have to come out. Because if you would give the tablet now, in this condition, all the worms are dying in the skin. And then instead of thousand worms, mm. you have thousand abscesses. Mm. And that is something that can kill you. That can even kill Hitler. Yeah, of course. <laughs> okay, Doc. So, Monday? Monday, yeah. Check up. Okay. I thought we will be happy to see you again, I'm sure. Hmm? This is the last Mango Worm video for today. I thought we really forgot to count. I'm very sad. Would have been a nice, nice new number for our record statistics. Most Mango Worms in a day. Good. Monday. Monday, okay. Monday is the next next big day and let's hope that Hitler feels better by Monday.